Hello, 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 and welcome back. My name is Sir Joust, and today we're covering uh, some more Fortnite content, sort of. Well, more more like exactly. Uh, it's your comments, right? And I really do appreciate you guys blowing up my comment section. Seriously, this is the most activity I've had. Um, and it's come to my attention that a lot of you guys have the same questions. Uh, so I want to just kind of put them all to rest right now. If you guys have more questions, comments, anything, definitely leave it, leave it below. And if you like this type of video, tell me. Uh, this is the first time I've ever done this uh, in the year that I've been a YouTuber. Because, let's, let's just be real, I wasn't super popular early on. But, starting out, we have the cash out killer. He says, nice video, bro. Was wondering, my friend is getting the deluxe edition that comes with the friend code. Was wondering, since he gets it four days early, will he also receive the friend code four days ahead? Overall, will I also be able to play four days ahead? Anyway, nice vid, bro. Well, thank you, Cash Out Killa, for the nice vid, bro. As you can see here, uh, Epic's actually already answered that. It says, uh, you know, when will I be able to see send my friend invites? Friend invites will be available to be sent in-game from the moment you are able to to purchase the early or participate in the early access so i'm reading that as on the 21st when you enter your codes your buddy can be sent like entering his codes as well um which means the two codes i'm giving out y'all will be able to play with me on release pretty freaking pumped about that next off we have mr banana waffle love the name how big is the fortnite how big is fortnite's alpha community now honestly i don't know um, I imagine the only people who do know are Epic and who they've given out the codes to. Um, I imagine it was pretty large. Right now, actually, I take that back. Right now, it's zero because all alpha codes don't work. So, yeah. How big it was? I don't know. Big. Another from Mr. Banana Waffle. Commander's XP is uh, for your skill tree. When the XP bar fills up, you receive one skill token and can spend it in the skill trees. Hope this helps. It does. Uh, so that's what that is. I was asking in the last video what commander's XP was. I was confused. It's not for the uh, the commanders that are making you know big videos, have a couple million subscribers. Um, it's for yourself. And I was kind of thinking, like, after I uploaded the video, I was like, that doesn't really make sense. Like, why would... Yeah. Um... So, that's good to know. Thank you very much, Mr. Banana Waffle. Chris Mitchell, actually responding to my uh, pay-to-win comment. If someone spent $400 and bought a ton of items, then sure, they would have a ton of great weapons, but pay-to-win, nah, it's not PvP. You don't compete against each other. You don't have uh, to ever see the same person you played with again if you don't want to. The amount of money someone else applies to their account is entirely irrelevant to other players. Other than that, good video. I like your style and the way you explain things. Good luck little little face see you in Fortnite. well chris mitchell uh, i was making that comment because i was watching the stream and i'll throw in the uh the clip right here we built Fortnite as like this living game like this living world like i described mm -hmm. um the thing that's the most done right now is our four player co-op but we've got 5v5 pvp which is like completely mind-blowing because if you can imagine like rebuilding your world like you know like you're building your base, you're building your fortifications, you're also like shooting people and like put enemies spawn into the world. Your spread, right? Yeah. Exactly. See, as you can see, she said they're they're playing a five v five uh I, I I I'm not listening to it right now. I can't remember exactly what she says, but you guys heard it. Um and it implied that there was at least PvP in the pipeline. I it's it's not there now. I know it's not there now. Um but in the future will it be there? Personally I think they should add it, but I mean, if they do, they're going to add some sort of regulation. Like, you can only have weapons up to this tier, or they're going to just provide weapons that you could play with, um, stuff like that. So it's actually a pretty easy thing. I don't think it will be pay to win. I actually completely agree with you, Chris, um, because, well, you know, it, it might actually be pay to win. Pay to win in the sense that you win the game quicker than everybody else, but who cares? Nikola Grujic. I hope I said that right. Just keep making Fortnite videos before the game comes. Smiley face. Keep us entertained. Are you not entertained? It's really hard to, to find new material. Because uh, all the all the other stuff... like, And I'm trying to stick directly to dev streams. Obviously, I could find other streams. Like somebody suggested I find a... There, she, she, specific, she or he... Somebody uh, suggested I... I take somebody's French stream, translate it, and post the gameplay with, like, what's happening. 
I really like that idea, but at the same time, I kind of feel like, I mean, I'm not stealing. It's under the fair use policy, but I don't know. If you guys want to see that, definitely say so in the comments. Chase Lamberson. Also, he said something else. Also, maybe some news on how the free-to-play model is going to work, mainly the microtransactions and their pricing. So the free-to-play model is free-to-play. Uh, it's something like League of Legends, like Paragon, um, you know, Clash of Clans, stuff like that. You download it, you can play it, and you have access to everything. You can achieve the highest level of the game without ever spending any money. However, if you want like sexy skins, you want maybe boosts to your pl progression, you want special weapons um, that are very hard to get, that's where the microtransactions come into play. And the way games are doing it nowadays, like Overwatch and... Uh, I don't know, Clash Royale, uh, you buy mystery boxes, you buy boxes that you don't know what's in them, and when you open them, you have a chance of getting blah. And in, the, in Fortnite, it's these llamas, and you have a chance of getting everything that's in them. That's, a def that's definitely a good way for them to do their marketing. Uh, it makes them a whole lot of money. It's kind of aggravating, but it also is kind of exciting, because you're like, yeah, I was lucky enough to get this, but realistically, you just spent, you know, 50 bucks to get this one item. So... Yeah, I hope that kind of answered your question. Chase Lamberson again. Hey, loving the Fortnite content. Content already pre-ordered. Can't wait to play. I have a question and possibly idea for a uh, video. What's the Founders Chat channel? Also, what does it entail? So this isn't long enough to actually make a video on, uh, but it is something that I want to address. Um, so the Founders Chat channel is literally, it's just that. It's a chat channel for the folks that are founders. Um, by buying a Founders Pack p past the standard edition, um, you get access to this Founders Chat channel, and I imagine it's just kind of a place to communicate. I don't see myself using it all that much. Maybe it's a way to speak with people, be like, hey, LFG, looking for group. Um, yeah, I mean, it's it's kind of like, hey, a free chat system within our game. Doesn't sound terribly exciting, in my opinion. It might be totally different, but that's what I've collected so far. Haven Hayes, as well as like half of you guys, I'm curious, Sir Joust, are you going to play Fortnite on PS4, Xbox, or PC? I'm on the PS4 because it would be cool to play with you. Hashtag Outlander Glenn. Uh, well, Haven Hayes, uh, I'm going to be on PC. However, I can still technically play with you on PS4. Cross-platform compatibility does not work right now. It's not something that they are going to implement with release. But PC and PS4 can share their data, right? So if you play it on PS4, you get really far and you decide, hey, I'm going to play it on PC, you can actually, as long as your account is linked through Epic Games, their website, um, as long as your account's linked, you can upload the game onto your computer, upload your profile, and actually play as though you're playing on your PS4, but on PC. Xbox, <clears throat> excuse me, Xbox doesn't have that because you have to buy through the Xbox Store, which is really stupid. Um, you also need the gold membership to play, even if you never, if, even if you play solo. Um, so Xbox, sorry, you're kind of out of luck. And uh, as of right now, cross-platform between all three is not available. I don't even know when it will be. Um, but yeah, I hope that answers that. I'm going to be on PS, I'm going to be on PC. There we go. That's the word. Uh, and I would love to play with all of you guys if I could. Sutulfrast. Oh, God. I'm sorry I'm butchering that. Aha, it'll be nice to follow you around, Sir Joust. As you begin your your YouTube journey with Fortnite. Thank you so much. Seriously. I'm actually terrified that like all of you guys are going to leave once you know your favorite YouTubers get a hold of this game. Um, and I'm freaking out, man. Um, but yeah, I'm glad you, you know, some of you guys are going to be sticking around. Uh, super appreciate that. Mr. Banana Waffle blowing up the chat. I think it's Zach. It's not Paul. Back at it again with those amazing videos. I told you not to correct me, Mr. Banana Waffle. But hey, I mean, I, I guess I guess it kind of got you featured on the video, so. Touche. Easy Beast, or 3ASY Beast. Do you have your code for a friend yet? Because when I bought mine, all I got was an email with a receipt. No. Uh, so they, they said in the email, and I'll pull that up. As you see here, uh, they say, we'll contact you when Fortnite goes live on July 21st. If you have any questions you can find the answers here it's just kind of like their facts commonly it's uh, asked questions and such uh, basically from the, the the Fortnite team so 
I imagine they're going to be sending out mass emails to everybody with their code, you know, their package, everything they need to, to know to get started, um, which means I'm going to be releasing the codes on the 21st. You guys have approximately three hours to get back to me. Otherwise, I'm picking somebody else. And I'll explain this all when I make the Discord server, but just throwing that out for the folks that are here this far. You guys got three hours. I'm gonna message you directly on YouTube. Um, you have you have to get back to me or I'm skipping over and giving them to somebody else. And on Mola, never mind, was derpy response. Sorry, it's okay, you're forgiven. Choco Monkey says, hey Joust, are you going to let us know what the Discord chat room code or URL later this week? Code or URL, URL later this week? I plan on releasing a video on the 15th, going over, I mean, it'll be like a really basic joining the server tutorial, as well as an in-depth discuss. It's going to it's gonna be a pretty big video, um, giving everybody everything they need to get into this giveaway. Um, so as of right now, you guys can, can cool it with asking for the code for the, the Discord server. It's not, I haven't even made it yet. Um, I, I, I wanted to take uh, about you know the next week or so to make sure all the the everything is perfect in it uh, before I, I, I release the code and have you guys swarm in. Miss Miss Ku Miss Miss Ku Miss Miss Monsieur Miss Ku. I don't know how to say your name. I apologize. I'm so glad that you've started videos on Fortnite. Your videos are amazing, man. In before one K subs hashtag giveaway hype. Uh, so this was one of the first comments I got. Um, and I was like in before 1k subs, pff, pff, pff. uh, but my channel's like blown up since I started doing this Fortnite stuff. Like I'm talking, I, my first video on Fortnite had 134 subscribers and I was getting like 13 views, 10 views, unless I was live streaming Paragon. People like the Paragon stuff, but I like doing like indie games. Those videos were sucking. I started uploading Fortnite and all of a sudden, I have doubled my subscribers in four days. So, holy crap. Uh, hype. Hashtag hype in general. Thank you guys for doing that. Board coding. Share the XP boosts around to people who don't win the game copy. Gets my vote. More winning for others. Keep up the data dumb. So, that's. I think that's what I want to do. Um, I get 40 uh, XP packs. I think I was going to give maybe five to... Uh, you know, everybody um, obviously need to have the game, and um, yeah, so that that's gonna have like what a total of ten winners, which will be pretty exciting. Everybody, like you guys, have a really good chance of getting this, uh, at least something, you know. And as far as the data dump, I've dumped all my data. I don't I don't know what else to cover. Uh, I'm running out of ideas, so my videos might slow down after this one. Um, not stop, but slow down for sure as I as I dig through the archives and find things that uh, haven't been covered already. Electric Sloth, need a squaw? You know where I'm gonna be for the 24 hours. Little winky face. Also, you should not just give out the extra copies just randomly, you should do it for a milestone, like 150 subs or whatever, just an idea. This was actually on my very first video I did for Fortnite, uh, at 150 subs. Well, I'm already at like 270, so not gonna do that. Um, and I am just going to give them away. Uh, I, I, I think the release of Fortnite is as good of a reason to give away the codes as any. But as far as he's going to be for the 24 hours, he's actually a streamer. Um, he has lifted me up when I was feeling down, and he, he does some pretty good content. So if you guys want to go check him out on Twitch, I would highly advise it. Dakius? Dakius? Daki? Dakias. Daki... Holy cow, I can't, I, you guys have some hard names. Uh, this person's actually uh, been commenting like on all the videos and with like substance, I mean paragraphs of just like their thoughts, ideas. Um, in fact, one of them was of like a, a de zoo of death, which I thought was amazing. Uh, so basically you, you funnel all the husks into one area and it's just going to be trap city. You just kind of mow them down. It's like shooting fish in a barrel. I'm really excited to try out all these different things in Fortnite, but you guys already know that. Anyway, Dakius says, oh, hey, not sure if this is the best place for this comment, but while we wait for the two weeks for Fortnite, are you interested at all in doing Paragon for beginners? I've played HOTS, but it seems rather difficult to get my head around the game. 
all the basics or getting started vids seem to be about a year or a year or more old and it seems the game has changed quite a bit since then anyways i don't want to jog your sword arm i have no idea what that means but consider it not jogged anyway i would a i would actually love to do like a paragon for beginners however i don't want what do you guys think uh if you if you've never seen paragon i would highly advise just voting yes um and if you have seen Paragon and you're like, eh, maybe not, then I don't know, don't. It's up to you guys, really. Uh, I love Paragon. It's my my lifeblood. It's it's kind of what got me boosted up to, you know, wanting to do videos more and, and, and doing YouTube and stuff. And uh, I'm pretty good at it. I have like eight years of League of Legends experience and only about a year of Paragon experience. But I, I can bring a lot of knowledge in the you know in a cool fun way um and uh if you guys are interested i have some live streams there's a couple videos on paragon you can check them out on my channel but that is actually it for the comments if you guys have anything else you want me to cover at a later date drop them below in the in the comment section it's where you guys spread your thoughts um i don't get notified on responses and replies so if you guys want me to cover something maybe in a video like this in the future uh, make a separate comment and be like, hey, I have this question, or hey, look at this information. Uh, it would really, really be appreciated, and it helps me out a whole lot. Um, it even, I mean, it helps out my channel, uh, because it shows activity on the, the video, and that helps ranking and, and SEO and all that jazz. But So if you guys are here this far, really appreciate you. Um, I was going to cover the trailer. Uh, I'm not anymore. I'll probably edit that out of the beginning, otherwise people are going to wait this long, not get it, and then rage. But uh, I do want to appreciate everybody for all the support they've shown this channel. Um, hitting that like button, subscribing, posting to other sources, all of that has just, like, <laughs> it's put this huge smile on my face and made me really excited, um, not only for Fortnite, but for YouTube and getting to know everybody here. Um, if you have any comments, I think this is like the eighth time I've said it, drop them in the comment section below. I respond to almost every single one, um, even if it's just like a silly comment. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. Hey, until next time.